Welcome back to the Comic Lounge. My name is Ryan, and today we're going to be talking about a book that came to my attention more recently due to a book called Prince of Cats by Ronald Wimberly, who is a cartoonist I discovered because of you know my friend at the shop, Nick. He told me about the book, and I and I read uh, his MF Grimm story that he drew for Vertigo, and I I just fell in love with his art and the way he. You can feel the hip hop and musical influence within his art. And so I picked up Prince of Cats after I read that MF Grimm book. And then I found out he did this too, which is really cool, especially because we're in Black History Month. While we shouldn't just be celebrating it just in February, I did think that it would be cool to kind of honor Black History Month by talking about this book, which is full of quotes by famous African-American uh people within history. It's, I mean, it's right there in the title, Black History in Its Own Words. And over, um, you know, he tells you how this book came about and he started it in, I'll, I'll read it real quick. Started in January, 2015, when he was asked to find eight quotes and illustrate them for the NIP for Black History Month. He chose quotes from, you know, luminaries, both past and present. And he had so much fun that he did for extra. And then he did, 12 more in 2016. And the this book includes the original 12 plus 15 new ones he did for 2017. And if you follow uh, his Instagram, he's also does, he's been doing some new ones as well. And he even did one with MF Doom, which RIP to MF Doom, man, we lost him this past year. And so it was kind of cool to see him do a couple quotes from him. And I just thought, you know, why not? I won't even read. I'll read some of the quotes. I'll kind of flip through, you know, just to kind of show you guys what this book's about. Because I think that anybody that likes books full of awesome quotes, this is a book that I highly recommend picking up. Because it's, it's cool and it's got people that you wouldn't normally see in a book full of quotes. Got Angela Davis. And then in each, you know, not only do we get the quote, but we get a little short paragraph of who the person is and where the quote was pulled from. MC Ride, George Joseph Harriman, and he is one of the forefathers of American cartooning, creating Crazy Cat, first cat and mouse cartoon, and would, you know, laid the foundation for uh, many to come and has influenced many great cartoonists. This one I love, you know, Ice Cube. Like I said, I'm a huge hip hop head, so I'm glad he threw um, an MC in that I really respect and admire. Got Saul Williams, one of my favorite, uh, one of my favorite comedians. We got Dave Chappelle in here. Spike Lee, one of the best directors to ever do it. Arturo Schomburg, Laverne Cox, James Baldwin, Lena Horne, Kimberly Bryant. I'm not familiar with her, but I really love this quote. Learn how to become a creator of technology and not just a consumer. I thought that was a really, um, that quote really stood out to me when I, when I read this book. Fred Hampton. Another one, peace to you if you're willing to fight for it. A lot of these are really, really powerful quotes. We got Serena Williams as well. There's Polly Styron. I haven't heard of her, but I, I love this too. I became a punk before anyone even coined the term. It's pretty dope too. Nikki Blanco, Octavia Butler. Every story I create creates me. I write to create myself. Another one, Zadie Smith. The wicked lie that the past is always tense and the future perfect. I mean, just so many fucking awesome people that he included. I mean, there's even people, I hope he does like a volume two because there's a lot of people that he, I wish were in here like Kobe Bryant or Tupac or, you know, Biggie. Malcolm X would be dope. Martin Luther King would be dope. But he really went for people that you don't normally see. And Jean-Michel Basquiat, amazing artist back in the 80s. And I love this too. I'm not a black artist, I'm an artist. And I think that that's, that's another thing, like, 
when people say it, it goes even like with women, right? When they're like, oh, is that a female writer? No, I'm a writer. You don't need to say whether she's female or she's male or they're male. You don't need to say black, white, Asian or, or Hispanic or any of that stuff. You know what I mean? And that's why I think that's a really dope quote as well. I love this Prince one too. The real power is community and actually connecting with people. This is a dope image too. I love that he's got the doves flying away. Nina Simone, amazing, amazing musician. And then one of my favorites, Muhammad Ali. Service to others is the rent you pay for your room here on earth. Dope, dope quote. Jimi Hendrix. And you know, there's a couple more in here too at the end, but I won't, I won't go through each one. Leave that for you guys who haven't been able to check this out, but I highly recommend picking this up. It's a, it's an awesome project. It's something that kind of eluded me when it first came out. You know, this is published by Image. And if you like this, pick up the rest of Ronald Wimberly's work, like the MF Grimm book that he illustrated, uh, Prince of Cats. Or if you've read those books and you're looking for more, pick this up. Uh, I know he does that lab magazine as well. I, I mean, I think the last one was a Kickstarter a little under a year ago. You can find him online. I'll throw the links down below too of where you can find him at because he's a dope cartoonist and you know I can't wait to see what he's got cooking next. Especially really hoping that we get a volume two of this Black History in some words. And just because February's Black History Month doesn't mean we should always be celebrating and admiring and respecting uh, Black creators. That should be happening 365, 366 on Leap Year. And hope you guys enjoyed this hope you pick it up and if you're not already following us follow us on facebook twitter and instagram at the comic lounge throw your comments or suggestions down below or email us to comic lounge pod at gmail.com like follow and subscribe and hit that bell icon so you're notified every time a new video goes up and on that note i'm out